Music licensing reimagined. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, my people. Hello, everyone. Yeah, it has been a while, right? So, I have hope. I'm like, yeah, today let me do something. Because um, I'm kind of excited, right? Um, welcome to Only My Story. You know, at Only My Story, we're here to own our stories, however good, bad, and ugly they are. Much as it's so hard, very hard to take South African food here in Canada. Uh, but there are, there are few stores, the first one in Ottawa, at the capital where I live, uh, that try. They try their level best to, to try to provide, to provide for music licensing reimagined. Um, West African food, maybe other African people, places have food really good varieties available for them but for us Ugandans it's quite tough sometimes so but there's a place which is like four kilometers from where I live that kind of have some yeah so I uh, okay you, you, okay you you always it's always try and error so you always try as much as possible to, I to I think that work for you like um I, I do get different kinds of cassava flour some call it flow, cut up or whatever, depending on your Indies. Music license. Uh, I do I've tried different kinds to find the one that's so nice so nice that suits me or that's good for me. Because we northerners of Uganda, we Lubaras, we West Nilers, we, we love our Inyasa, right? So I've been trying different varieties. I remember sharing a photo, uh, sharing a photo of one in your saw that I made, um, that I bought, that I made, and I posted it on Facebook, and people gave all kinds of opinions. So yeah, that's the trial and error, right? So now I, the last time I bought this, um, yeah, you can see it's written there, pure cassava. Music pure. licensing, we um, um, Where is it from? Where is it from? made by aha uh -huh. this is a product of Ghana but I've tested it at least it's it's, it's one that tastes familiar to what we eat from West Nile what we eat from Arua so I now resorted to this I normally buy it so I've run out of it so I went and bought two of them with my receipt guys I'm going to the receipt so quickly yeah but I don't remember how much this uh, how much it was in particular yeah this I bought two of them. Yeah, it's eight, eight ninety nine dollars. Let me calculate that for us in Ugandan shillings. Music sevens. licensing <laughs> reimagined. Card to Ugandan shillings. There you go. So we're doing our eight point ninety nine, guys. This is this this olafura here, which is like one point three kilograms. This anyafura here. Is going at two thousand twenty two hundred twenty five thousand eight hundred twenty five thousand eight hundred. I placed I own. So I got two of them. Then the only thing this Ugandan that I was able to get, of course, was this Maganjo Millet. So I normally mix it, mix this Millet with the Dollar Fora, and then to get that Avenia Sara. You know, that is a lot of the people So this was costing ten dollars ninety nine. Maganjo, or the one kilogram maganjo, was costing me ten dollars That's like thirty one thousand Ugandan cents. And you can imagine this is even more costly. The millet, our maganja millet from Uganda is more costly than this cassava flour that comes from what? From Ghana. Yeah, but so I wanted to eat it. I was craving it so bad, so I had to get it. But what am I using it to prepare? I want to eat. This is Mdrokolo. Music licensing reimagined. So this is Mdrokolo. Um, they call it Molokia. By the way, Molokia. Even the people from Middle East eat a lot of these things. Of course, Middle East, Western, West Africa, and like I didn't know Mondrokolo is actually a, a widely eaten delicacy. You know, 
So at least you find it even in the main store. This is this one I found it in the main main bigger store, not specifically. But the anyafora, the the millet flour and the, and the anyafora and everything, I got them from there. Uh, from the from the from, from African from African store. So yeah, that's what I want to prepare today. I want to prepare this with with beans um, with um, at the bottom. One without the cover. Okay, the one Music licensing the cover. reimagined. Uh, I want to prepare what's called ajira. You know ajira. So yeah, that's what I want to prepare today, and then I want to enjoy. I want to, oh, and then I'll I'll prepare the ajira, put peanut butter in it, and then make the nyasa. I'll share with you guys the, the photo, the outcome of those. I'll share the photo for you guys to see, and then yeah. That's what I want to eat today, but I was like, oh, it has been a while, 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 you know. Um, I'm going to be sharing Heartless my life. Since this is only my story, where we get all my stories, I'm going to own the stories that I'm, I'm, I'm creating here, in, in, in terms of my experiences here, and food being, me being a foodist that I've always told you guys, I think you now that I know that part. So, yeah, today I'm preparing this Mugrokolo, which is called Molokia. licensing, reimagine. Okay, I'm preparing today with also Ndoza, which is beans. They have beans with all the husks. I don't know, husks. Oh, the beans, the beans with all the cover. I don't even know how to do it. I cooked it the other time. I was trying to defrost it. Yeah, this, this is the beans. I already cooked it. So I cooked it, but I didn't have the Molokia. I didn't have the Mondrocolo, so I'm coming to finish it. So, yeah, I'll keep you posted and thanks for the love. Please keep passing by. Music licensing reimagined. I'll be sharing um, different experiences that I'm having here in Canada. I know people, some people who know about Canada even more than me. Uh, would like to know what life is like in Canada, like I just shared with you today. Accessing African food can be quite so. I can tell you, I bought these, these, two of these, and two of these, and plus some artless IO, plus some three platin, and that costed me $42. That's like um, $42. Let's see how much that is in Ugandan savings. Just so you know, the cost of living here. $2. That's like a hundred. Music licensing reimagined. But since I'm alone by myself, I eat all this by myself. At least the the flowers, the millet, and the cassava plants will take me at least a while. Yeah. Yeah. Um, cost of living, I think, basically very high almost everywhere. But yeah, that's it for today. Hey, yes. um, I hope I, I don't miss you out on sharing the pictures of how my. Rock or Mohammed Jira will come out like what? Artless IO.